No, there may be uh, some dew later on which might uh, not work in favor of the Indians. A win here for South Africa will uh, give them the lead in the one-day series. So Smith will be aware of all that. Captain of the side. And already at the age of 24, one of South Africa's leading batsmen. And very experienced these days, playing his 72nd game. Average to shade under the 40 mark, strike rate healthy as well. Whip that away. Chases on the outfield has obviously got a little bit heavy and a bit slower, but it's still got enough to go for four. Yes, he gets into a good position here, the South African captain. Nice way to get off the mark. Gets across his thumbs and then uh, plays late. Allows the ball to... Uh, we've been focusing on a lot throughout the series. He doesn't mind him there, Smith. He's put that away for a boundary. Round one to Smith. Yes, it was almost as if he was expecting it. Onto this in a flash. Keeps it down to... Well, he has this ability to hit the boundaries early on. That is where he can't bowl. Slightly short and slightly wide. He'll get hammered by Smith. Well, that's a tremendous shot, and it's put pressure on Agarkar straight away, trying to overcompensate here, getting outside the off stump. Well, that's good enough for Smith to free his arms. Again, a little bit on the shorter side, but uh, extremely well struck. Great. Chase that one. Hasn't got everything on it. The outfielders. Uh, a little bit slower than it was earlier today, but it still runs away for four. Back-to-back -back boundaries for Smith. Slice that away for four. Well, he's in a hurry at the moment, the South African captain. But this is a much better length from uh, Patan. And Smith reaching out. Uh, Anything uh, was a little on the wider side, allowed him to free his arms. Yes, he's going to chase, he's going to slash at anything wide. He's a very difficult batsman when he's in form to bowl to. Nicely played, mid on was extremely wide. That went through the region where a standard mid on would be positioned. It's gone for four. Now this is a very good shot and uh, Smith would like actually to play the shot uh, more often than he does. It's the full face of the blade. Normally he works the ball on the onside. I feel he'll be a much, much better player if he can. Pulled away by Smith. He has played very well in this inning so far. Well, as Ravi Shah did mention a few times, that he's a big man, but for a big man, he gets into positions very quickly. And no half measures. When he hits the ball, it stays hit. Bound punch it onto the onside. Fight. Well, he finds the gap on this occasion. That should get him to a half century. Very fine innings this from the South African captain. Leading from the front and the dressing room know it. Just the perfect beginning for the South Africans. 189 to get 50 to Smith, unbeaten. He's such an important member of this South African scheme of things. In the beginning, just provides the momentum plays very freely very positively 50 of 50 balls yeah, boundaries and sixes 42 of the 62 and the sweep and super placement two fielders behind the umpire on the onside and he still found the gap 
really playing a fabulous innings, pacing it perfectly. Aggression interspersed with some discretion. This is perfectly placed. Getting his foot right across and then finding the they don't lose the series. So the big one. That is four. Good use of the feet again. An aggressive hit. Well past the bowler before he could get done. Yes, once again down the track in a flash. That is a superb shot. Welcome back in the attack, Mr. Agata. Well, he's been outstanding, Brad Smith, with the bat. It's a man in good form, leading from the front. And he is seeing the ball very big indeed. Four from the moment it left the bat. Don't bother running. That's nicely timed as well. That's right off the bottom of the back, but it's raced away for another boundary. Terrific drive from Smith. The ball is now coming into the ladder, skidding off the surface and coming on beautifully from the seamers. Successive boundaries. One was good, the other one was even better. This time opening the face and getting it to the right of middle. The placement was excellent. He's got another one. Agarka back in the attack. Three balls later. He's gone for three fours in a row. Let's take Smith into the 90s. Now he'll be a magnificent hundred when he gets there. Two deliveries pitched up. Slag for a four. Typical fast ball is reaction. Marginally shot. And he is looking very good touch. Positive from the outset. That's it. He hits it for four. Immediately raises his arms. The, gr the ground are on their feet. It's, it's remarkable scenes. But a remarkable innings. His fifth one day international century and exactly a run of all 103 of 103 and it brings up 150 as well on to off stump as it were and otherwise he stood there and played Virtually every ball on its merit, and that's four more on the offside for him. And there's an example uh, of what I was saying, the way he's improved his uh, cricket against the spinners as well. Here he's beaten in the flight, but he holds his position, knows exactly where he wants to hit the ball, and uh, plays it late and gets it into the gap. You can see he just waits on it. Tucked away as well, there will be four more. <laughs> Bull boy has converged. Over the top of mid off. Smith is in such control. That's his highest score in one day internationals. And what a place to do it. Once again, the footwork positive, assured, he knows what he's doing. Another beautiful drive from Smith, beating mid off with sheer power. Awesome power. He sort of tended to move back, making space for himself, stayed outside. Dude. And that's beaten mid on. And we'll go away for four more. What a player.
187 without loss. Saving one now. Is he going to go along the ground? Or is he going to go over the top? In the 36th over. That's it. 2 1 South Africa. And a simply out performance from the man on in picture a moment ago Graham Smith